okay this custom room is back after a, some time or you can say after a long time you can say this is project blaze and i hope you know this custom room i made a video on some of the previous versions already and yes this is based on android 15 this is a beta version i'm talking about version 4.0 which is a beta version official version i've installed on my device Based on Android 15, it brings you some amazing features which are actually quite good as it is in a beta stage so definitely some bugs are expected. But yes, taking a look at some of the things, first of all you will notice that we have Pixel Launcher pre-installed. And yes, Pixel Launcher has some benefits and also some disadvantages. It's up to you. How do you think about it? How you look after it? But in my case, Pixel Launcher is actually good enough. You just notice it's pixel launcher you also have the light quick settings panel and also even in the wallpaper and style ui we have ai wallpaper support we have emoji workshop which is a very good thing and ai wallpapers definitely working fine if you use ai wallpapers then this could be a very useful thing for you including that all the pixel exclusive things or you can say pixel 9 wallpapers etc are already a part of the latest google pixel wallpapers app which is already included as it is Android 15, so you can see we have new UI in wallpapers and style and whenever you try to apply any wallpaper, we have new UI because that is a part of Android 15 and it is based on Android 15. One thing let me show you if you talk about the circle to search, it is here, it is working fine. Yes, we have Pixel Launcher pre-installed. So one of the things which was which was actually quite amazing to see and that was circle to search it is here it is working fine one thing keep in mind whenever you try to check the circle to search if it is working fine or not make sure to find if google app is updated you need to update your google app from google play store and also some of the google play services related things so that circle to search might work perfectly for you Talking about the customizations, talking about the features which you have in this one by default included, some of them are so good. One more thing, if you take a look at the system options in Blaze House, you will find the option named as revamped dashboard. What this is, we have a different sort of settings UI. By default, you just notice right now and let me show you. This is the previous Blaze House or if you have ever used Project Blaze previously, this was a UI which was already implemented and it's available with Android 15 too. So we have the option available if you want to use Android 15 style settings UI or this Blaze specific settings UI. Including this one, we have some of the useful things like Google Play Integrity Spoofing, Advanced Restart, etc, etc. And uh, some of the few options, few tweaks related to lock screen, as you can see. Hide quick settings in the secure lock screen. Also have some of the options and tweaks related to quick settings panel. And some of the options related to background transparency. Although it's not completely like we have the blur available, it's not like that. But it is here and the transparency level, I guess, if you need, if you actually want to make it look better, I guess 90%, above 90% will look fine. Other than else, status bar options are quite similar and theming options are also quite similar. As you can see, fonts, icon pack, almost similar options. The good thing is that it's based on Android 15. So based on Android 15, having all these customizations and features is a good thing. And as I just told you at the starting of the video, it's a beta update. So some of the minor bugs are expected also depends upon which device you are using. Take a look at some of the other things. What I found here is the app lock. It is available, it is working fine, so that is a good thing. It's Android 15 and some of the Android 15 based custom rooms are not able to provide you app lock. Also because this custom room brings you pixel launcher pre-installed which means app lock and hiding the apps is a very, very useful thing. And definitely quite worthy if you use hide apps feature, if you, if you lock apps on a device, this could be a useful thing for you. As Android 15, it's based on Android 15, so we have private space. And one of my favorite features of Android 15, so we have now private space available, which is a different thing from work profile, as I always mention in my other videos too. If you love private space, definitely you can try Project Blaze and you will not miss private space. As far as I know, 99.9% .9 of the custom rooms are now giving you private space by default because it's part of Android 15. But like some of the custom rooms, I guess, which are actually uh, quite different ones might not provide you private space, but most of the custom rooms will. But in this case, let me show you, I just enabled the hide private space option. That is a different thing. 
as you can see it's now hidden so if i search here i will be able to find it but if you use any other launcher for example launcher 3 which is available in some of the custom rooms by default then unfortunately you cannot find out this you have to edit you have to find it unlock it in the settings app volume panel it also a part of android 15 although the new volume panel is a part of project glaze already but in some of the custom rooms it's not changed so yes it's available it is uh, this is the new volume panel introduced with android 15 it is here and definitely in my personal opinion i like this thing talking about one more thing here as you can see device is certified so my device is play product certified and you have to click on play store version seven times to open the developer options and here you have to find out check integrity like some of you use some apps uh, sometimes the app does not work for you this is a great method working fine and as you can see device basic both integrity passing without any issues you don't need strong in some cases so definitely it's worth it so yes, these were the things just wanted to let you know if you want to try it out on a device for some of the devices, it's available officially. So check this out. If this is not, you can try out unofficial. This is it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.